Hello. Thank you for watching this video. This is a lovely house. Street front house in Brea Avenue. Five bedrooms, four garages. What more can you ask for? Let me show you. So this is an entrance to your front door. You've got a sliding door there on the side that can also work as an entrance. And then on the right hand side here you've got uh, stairways going up to your entertainment lapa. Uh, which means people also don't have to necessarily go through your house. Um, there is a borehole. It's got an electric fence. So there's the borehole. Very strong borehole. There is sprinklers, but that does need a bit of attention. I think the front sprinklers work, but the back sprinklers need a bit of attention. Um, you've got a double carport in front of this double garage. And then you've got another double garage. So if you don't have six cars, you can definitely have some workshop space. It's close to the corner of Fry and Brea. So you can see there's a trelly door um, at the entrance and then you've got this big solid wooden door which is lovely. You've got an entrance for you which you can make a statement of your personality and then on the right hand side here we've got your home office, uh, laminated wooden flooring, air conditioned home study, home office, very very nice. And then also at your entrance you've got a guest toilet so if somebody does come to your office nobody has to go through your house to use the toilet. And then we go into the living areas. So you've got a very spacious lounge ceiling fans, tiled floor and um, you've got a breakfast nook in your kitchen African Grey is a little bit scared of the camera and here you've got your dining room and yeah, you've got a very spacious Second lounge. It can work very, very nicely as an amphitheater. You put your chairs on the stairway and uh, your screen down the side. This piece of wall here under the arch is all drywall, so if you wanted to remove it, you could. And then you've got your entertainment lapa, built-in braai. This sail just closes down. That's where your entrance is from the street side. And you've got more sails for those winter days uh, when it might be a bit cold or even rainy. And you just lower the sails down. And uh, I'll show you the swimming pool area. So you've got a sliding gate. Yeah, it's running on a rail, uh, which makes it very easy to camp your dogs in a certain area. You've got a second lap upstairs, which is nice if you've got teenage children and they've got their own area where they can sit. Personally, I think this was the original lap of the house uh, because there is a built-in braai here as well and then you've got your swimming pool which 
is a lovely blue color. It's got a heat pump. And you've got a nice view over the house from here. So as we move around the pool, you can see the heat pump here on the left hand side. I just want to show you this bit of garden on this side as well. Not too big to maintain, but also not too small. Let's go and look at the bedrooms now. Okay, so we're going back through the lounge area now and we're going to look at the bedrooms. You've got another safety gate here in the passage. And uh, this is the first bedroom. Ceiling fan, laminated wooden flooring, burglar bars, nice light color. You can see the two, the two safety gates. Then we've got another bedroom currently being used um, as an dining room because there's five bedrooms and not so many people living here. Built-in cupboards, tile floor, ceiling fan. Next bedroom. Double bed easily fits in. Ceiling fans as well. There's a heat up against the wall. Burglar bars. Your fourth bedroom, also built in cupboards, also with a double bedding, also with burglar bars, style floor, ceiling fan. And then we've got a separate shower, separate toilet, and a separate bath. Then we've got our main master bedroom with the master en suite, air conditioner, ceiling fan, tile floor, and some wires, uh, TV wires that's coming through the roof there, plugs in the room, lots of cupboards. And you've got your main bathroom, his and hers, dual vanities, toilet with a bath. and a shower. <clears throat> so you can go into the kitchen from two sides. So this is your kitchen area. Got granite countertops with wooden cupboards, solid wood. I don't know what type of a wood this is. And then the ceiling is a is an olive pine that's been painted white. Double eye level oven. There's an extractor over the hob. You've got your salad prep bowl on this side. Space for a double door fridge. It's also a ceiling fan in the kitchen. And. Uh, then you've got your scullery area on this side. Scullery laundry. Lots of space. It's quite a big room. Also got a ceiling fan. And then this door goes outside. 
to the servants quarters okay so outside of the kitchen door you've got a covered roof uh, with polycob uh, to let in light and then you've got uh, this roof extends quite quite away you've got a windy house on the right hand side here which is all under the under the roof and um, on this side you've got uh, little gates going off into the backyard your geezers are outside you can see the electric fence going all around and uh, this door goes into the second double garage which I'm going to show you how you can walk around your house completely you can have dogs walk around your house completely so there we go around the corner place for your dirt boxes yeah unfortunately we caught them on washing day so this door goes into the other double garage but there is a servants a servants room here also with a ceiling fan in tiled floors with a toilet and a shower which I think is all you need I just want to show you the inside of the of the one garage or another entrance to that garage so here's the other entrance to this garage So now you've had a chance to look at the house. I'll be glad if you give me a ring so that I can show you in person. Thanks for watching my video.